So we're uh, when we uh, first did it, um, first turbo, first put the turbo on. We just used the original, whoop, the original exhaust. I'm um, just made like an adapter to go onto there. So we're going to take this opportunity to build like a proper three-inch exhaust all the way up through. So we've obviously done the. Uh, battery tray delete we'll find something to block that up at some point sooner and we're properly excited because um this has got a res on it and we can delete it nice res delete on this one res delete oh let's do everything delete everything delete hmm. except the turbo and the supercharger we don't want to delete that for a minute do we? i think it'll do engine delete man. engine delete soon yeah piston delete yes <laughs> we've uh upgraded to the r56 calipers only because we had some some nice hell pink braided hoses there's a pretty shock absorbers and we've obviously got our racing wheels Excellent! We've also taken the time uh, whilst it's up on the ramp. We don't get the car on the ramp very often. It's usually got um, customers' cars on it. But we've taken the time to sort of uh, just go through it for track days next. We usually try and change oil every couple of track days, but oils and gearlocks. Um, we've got like an LSD in the box, um, like an M factory one. So again, just trying to keep it all sensible. And you know, we'll probably sell the box once we've finished, um, once we've got the DSG in there. So. Again, it's worth doing, so we put some castor oil in it. Um, it just, there's the, like the exhaust is uh, completely straight all the way down through, three inch, um, one box at the back end. So yeah, looking forward to, uh, looking forward to getting the brakes on and uh, getting it on the dyno, see what happens. Okay, we're, uh, we're pretty much finished now um, on the next revision of this thing. We've got to do brakes still. We've done the rear brakes because we had some drama. Um, we've got the new front brakes. We're going for the Brembo calipers. Um, I just thought I'd run you through um, the next revision, what we've done. Um, we're hoping to get another couple of free track days in this year. Um, hopefully it'll keep going. We haven't thrown a rod yet, but you never know. Um, over Christmas, we're planning on um, putting the DSG gearbox in it. We've got a DQ250, we've made the adapter plate and such like, but um, the fact of the matter is it needs to be up on the on the ramp for a few weeks, um, well, a couple of three weeks at least. We've got to sort out drive shafts and mounts and stuff. Um, so the Christmas period seems like a good time to do that. Um, so our new front end um, is now finished. Um, we can now take the bumper on and off with just some split pins um, so it's literally just come on and off in seconds we've got um, some extra breathe some extra air intakes here which are going to go around for the brake ducts um, so we come out of the turbo through the intercooler we then we we had various boost leaks um, and we couldn't resolve it so it just got to the point where we were okay let's just Let's just weld some bits in there and just get it resolved properly. Um, chargers ain't any money anyway, so so out of the out of the charge cooler, uh, down into the supercharger in the rear, out of the supercharger, um, and down round through front mount, and then up through the back into here. We've got a little dump valve here as well, and um, straight into our new throttle body. So um, the what else have we changed? So we have also changed. We've got like a previously the exhaust we had a three inch downpipe from the turbo um, and we just joined that in to where the original exhaust was it was some sort of um performance type exhaust but it was obviously just crap so um we've now made like a three inch stainless pipe right the way through and we've lit with a, a back box under the we've cut the battery tray out and put a back box under there um we're quite fortunate a couple of friends have managed to get us have bits and pieces to do that so um, thanks to John and James for the bits and pieces to allow us to do that. So we've now got a fringe exhaust all the way through instead of being reduced um, to the smaller one. We've gone up a size in supercharger pulley as well. So we're going to be putting a supercharger under more work um, and less so from the turbocharger. We're just really just to see what difference that makes. Um, it's just going to be interesting to see how it does perform. Um, Methanol obviously back in. So yeah, we'll. Get the brakes done, a um, couple of little minor bits and pieces, um, throw it back on the dyno and see how differently it behaves. Um, and then back out the coom and see if we can't throw some rods, I guess.
brought this graph up. This green line is how the car used to be. Um, this was with a 17% per usual mods GP ECU. Admittedly, it didn't have a camshaft. It was completely stock engine. Um, and that's about what they'll make on this dyno. Um, that was on the 380cc injector. So 206, 210 horses is a good is a good power. Um, let's do like 175 foot pound of torque. Hopefully, you can see it on this camera. Um, so the red lines are now what it's presently doing in its highest boost point. We can go a little bit more early, but I scaled it back very slightly because I'm just <laughs> we've got a drag day in a couple of days, and I'm frightened we're just going to absolutely grenade it all to pieces. So you can see from the graph the actual power difference. What we've done now is we're on the absolute arse end of um, what this turbocharger can supply. It will not do any more late on, which is where we want it. So we're going to investigate that different turbocharger. Um, what we do, I don't know. Um, for a minute, it will stay like this, I think, because we, we've got other things to concentrate on getting this, uh, getting this DSG gearbox in. But you can see that at the peak, the, 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 the final point, which is where our turbocharger is just not doing the business. We're only, you know, 20 horse up, peak point, seven, seven, one, seven, two, whatever. Um, we're still up there, but everywhere else, it's it's massive, significant gains. Um, and when you look at like the peak torque, 175 is what it used to be. We're now at 320 foot pound of torque. Um, our maximum BHP is happening at five and a half thousand now. Um, previously, it was happening here. And, and again, um, just the distances um, between these lines, the area beneath the graph, you can see how much faster the car is and how much faster it feels actually. That the torque's phenomenal. It's like a it's like a bloody petrol diesel engine that just revs and revs and revs. But it's really interesting. So as I say, we've now got another twenty horse up from where we went, um, but all our inlet temperatures are just staying stable. Um, it's so much nicer now. So, I guess the next bit will be um, the next little video will be at um, Coom again, um, where we'll put her through her paces with the new brakes on. Um, probably, maybe the last track day this year. I want to do Thruxton really. Um, maybe the last track day this year um, before we start throwing the gearbox into it. Um, we will. The, the, the whole car has been built. On an absolute shoestring, as you're probably aware. Like if you've followed any of the videos, um, there's a reason we've been doing this, and um, the reason that we've been doing this is such so bloody phone. Is we're going to get a DSG box in the front. This car is essentially just going to be a throwaway thing. Um, we've got another car which we've been putting together, um, a decent shell. Um, and we wanted to do something a bit more interesting with it, so you know we're, we're building another one properly, which we'll introduce you to at some point soon. But it, it'll be fairly mad. Um, well, it is fairly mad. It'll be fairly interesting. Hopefully, you'll uh, you'll enjoy that. I'll do a little build video thing that we're doing with that. But yeah, it'll be interesting. Um, so yeah, I'll, um, next video will be at Coom. <laughs>